New developments tonight as U.S. troops try to get to the Pendleton Base Huey helicopter. It crashed in this Nepalese mountainside as it was trying to reach earthquake victims. All six Marines and two Nepalese soldiers on board are presumed dead. To news reporter Hannah Mullins is live in Miramar. And Hannah, a parents, a pilot's parents are trying desperately to hold on to hope. They are, but they know it doesn't look good. Their son was on a newer model of a Huey like that when it went down. And I'm going to miss those hugs. I really, really am. Terry and Ron Norgren are still figuring out if they should talk about their son in the past tense. But I know in my heart that Chris is doing what he wanted to do. Captain Chris Norgren was a pilot on board the Huey along with Sergeant Eric Seaman. His wife told me he's an amazing dad. Lance Corporal Jacob Hugg's mom wears a dog tag that matches his tattoo. Says, I will be strong and courageous. I will not be terrified or discouraged. He was on board shooting video with this pilot. My name is Captain Lucas Savage, and we stand with Nepal. We're told the aviation safety officer may be an expecting dad who may never have the chance to meet his child. So we were uh, able to deliver some rice, potatoes, and tarps out to smaller villages just east of Kathmandu. That's the last we knew before the radio cut out. Marines spent days searching for their brothers before Nepalese soldiers spotted the wreckage in a thick forest. It was 11,000 feet up in below freezing temps with violent winds. This was personal for Lieutenant General John Whistler. Those were his Marines. We are deeply saddened by the discovery of this wreckage. Whistler called off recovery efforts until sunlight so they wouldn't lose any more. They were courageous. They were selfless individuals dedicated to the international humanitarian aid mission here in Nepal. Norgren gave a lot of himself and didn't forget to send mom flowers on Mother's Day, the last time they heard from him. Thank you, Chris, for remembering your mom on Mother's Day. I know you're very busy in Nepal. And I can't be any prouder of it than today and right now. If they didn't make it, they certainly died honorably. We're live at MCAS Miramar, Hannah Mullins, 10 News.